Hello YouTube, welcome to episode 10 with the dream, with Damien right now. We're live on Twitch, we're currently 5 hours and 40 minutes into our Twitch stream, so if you haven't checked us out on Twitch, follow the link in the description below when you finish watching the video, or maybe just do it right now, it would be nice, I love an interactive stream, it's been not a bad stream so far as well at the moment here. Um, for everybody here on Twitch, if you're in the chat, say hello, let me know your score prediction for the game that's about to happen, but we'll get into that in a second. For everybody on YouTube, when you laugh, less us. if you haven't watched it, go watch that back now, that's your warning. We laughed less left us. We were sitting mid-table in the Prem. We're now top. Look how tight the Premier League table is right now. After eight games, a lot of weird old names. United and City found their way back into them. Arsenal, Everton, Fulham, Bournemouth and Stoke, who were obviously top in and around it as well when we last let. But if we look at our fixtures, we obviously was the last game we saw was this one here after losing the RBL in the Champions League group stage. We then lost to Watford, right, in the um, in the Cabo in the Cabo Road Cup, but we did play quite a re reserved side. No one playing quite well was that Olioff actually finally had a decent game, um, only because we conceded. We then beat Chelsea at home in what was an important game. Say is getting two. We then beat Olympiacos 10-1 in the Champions League. We then beat Stoke 5-2, and then we dominated and the Living Dialects out of Watford, finally putting it away. Um, there is an important thing to note, is in this Stoke game, Bradley, um, as say has got injured, pissed, twisted his knee. Bradley will come off the bench and score two. So when we look at today's team, which is obviously our game is against Finewood, we've got to do a double header, Finewood, and then play these two games in Finewood again for YouTube. If you're on Twitch, you'll see both these games as well. Um, we are going to have to play with um, Ward up front and Gary Davis off the bench because Sayers is not 100% ready. I need him for the Premier League games as well, so there's no point risking him. In saying that, if there's ever a time to risk him, this could probably be the group. You can probably see it there, but just to make sure my face isn't in the way. Um, as you can see, we're currently um, um, we're currently in third on three points. Five, um, the RBL just played as well, and they beat Olympiacos 2-1. Our goal difference isn't too bad, though. Um, we will jump ahead of final if we win and go into second, but obviously RBL, um, can, um, RBL um, can't, haven't beat final and be on them points, but we can't go ahead of RBL. It's very weird. Um, but everybody will be tired at the moment. We should never have lost that game to RBL. We know about that it was last episode, but hopefully we can do well right now. Instead, we're going to get into it. Bradley Ward has got to start with Alessio, Brad, um, Santa Maria Martinez, Pereira, Centeno, Florian has been in very good form. Wood, Woodward, Graham, and um, Ransom, the um, Champions League goalkeeper. Um, as we can say, um, with Florian's been in, being in good form, I'm definitely going to start playing him a little bit more. It's got to be picking teams on form. Um, Alessio has been in good form. Um, Ward's been in good form off the bench. The reason we're not playing 4 2 3 1 is I feel like away from home we need to play 4 3 3. Um, and that's what we've been doing against the big boys, especially. It's been working. And then we're playing 4 2 3 1 at home and dominating sides off the park. And that's what we're going to go with here. We've got to proceed this match now and get into it. If you're in the chat, let me know your score, um, your, um, score predictions. And there we are. I'm going to get into it there. Um, so they've obviously got Milivojevic up top. We're just typing into the Discord there quickly as well as I'm part of an FM Discord as well as Dr. Benji's Discord. The Italian looks okay as well. Carver Bell there looks all right. They're a very solid side. They are top for a reason. We have to win this game to obviously go um, to six points. We have to be on the same points as RB on that after losing one. Across there looks decent. Um, Denzotti looks okay as well at the back. Um, Martina looks very good at the back as well. This is a team that's been dominating Dutch football. If we look at the Dutch league quickly, we find we'll see they've been winning it every single year, basically. Um, their key player is the centre midfielder, the Norwegian as well. Um, and then in goals, they have Redim as well. they solid, solid team. Just We should be slightly better then, but obviously away from home, um, we have to go and give them a little bit more respect because we can't afford to lose this game and then look to go for it a little bit later on. In terms of instructions, I'm just going to see what they, um, my assistant says. And I say that, I'm also going to just try and make sure their striker doesn't do anything today as well. And get into that one there. Get into the tunnel. Um, I'll pick myself, my team myself. Pretty happy with how it's looking at the moment. And we've gone into there. Pereira gets onto to Martinez and Bradley Ward. Martinez has been in sensational form lately. So has Santa Maria. They've both been playing quite well. So hopefully we can continue this run of form at the moment and go and win here away at Finewood. Saying that early free kick to Finewood. Lays it top of the box. Can we go and close that one down? Two kick on it. Good cross back post. Header. Well, one nil down straight away to a header there. Back post. Rennie Busti. It gets what we wanted to do here, which was just be solid. But once again, we can see to another free kick. It's just not good enough. Another cross-back post. 
Look, this Champions League campaign is getting a lot more squeaky bum than what we need it to be. That is for sure. Not dominating, nominating the possession at all as well. Not really creating. I'm going to tell them to get creative, see if we can do something. But if nothing happens in the next 10 minutes, we're switching to the 4 2 3 1 and going out, out after final. The ball to Martinez, here we go. Find Santa Maria. Can we go and work something? That's a poor ball. Centeno's high up the field as well, but that's the way we play. In the end, Torrey gets on it. Can we press him in and win this ball? Come on, boys. Can we win it? Forcing him to play square. It's a nice long ball, but that's what we want. And Graham gets on it. Finds Brad. Brad now on it. Looks for Bradley Ward. Bradley Ward, what a finish. That's why I'm so happy that when we... um Not happy that Sayers gets injured, but I'm so happy in terms of we got the quality off the bench and striker. As much as it doesn't look like that in terms of star ratings, they can grow. Both Davis and Bradley Ward can grow into great players. And they've also got that just that raw, natural, I've got good finishing composure. And just to hit that front first time in the outside of the foot, far post, is brilliant. So we go to 1-1 one, one here. Um, starting to eke and dominate the game. I only give them one shot, which I don't mind playing this little system that, you know, we're pretty good defensively. Um, we'll see how we go, though. We can't afford to lose this game. We have to go out and win this game. Can we get another highlight before half time? That would be great. It doesn't look like it's coming. Oli's not having the best of year as well. You know, our star centre back it's worth 70 million. He's not having a great year at all. But we'll see how we go. And yeah, out here at half time, it's 1 1. Um, I'm going to tell him I'm not happy with the performance and get him fired up. What we are going to do is we're going to switch to the 4 2 3 1 because I haven't seen enough from Final to warrant us getting worried. Got to get Pereira Dick more punish more. Get some Martina into here. Get Ward as an advanced forward still. And everyone else the same. And just get us bombing on, right? This is the system we used against um, Olympiacos, which were much better then. So hopefully second half we can go out here and score a couple goals early would be nice. And then we can get into it. Um, and this system is just a little bit more aggressive in the terms of the press and the way we play and everything like that as well. 53 minutes. Not much happening in terms of what's happening out there. We might need to get Alessio off. He's having a poor one, the Italian. He's been in good form of late. But Benny Ott's going to come in there and try and change the game. And hopefully we can create something now. I'm not going to panic and go to the counter or anything because we are dominating the game. But I will panic if we concede from a corner. Can we press out and fire and press Trosseros? He gets in the box, lays it, edit, bang. Oh my God, it's offside. Thank God for that. Must have hit the person that must have hit was in offside position, and we've got to get away with that one there. Thank God for that one. There we go. Can we just tell the lads to go get creative, get out there, work a chance, get the goal, get go ahead. We need to win this game. That final no draw is really good here away from home. We have to win this game. We're not in the best of positions. Here we go. We have to go for it. Don't want to go for it a little bit more. Much higher tempo, the more direct, um, but close it down a little bit more to go a bit more attacking. Yes. Gary Davis has to come on here. Santa Maria's not having the best of games. We're going to go to two up top as well. Get Ward on one side, Gary Davis on the other side. And we're just going to have to go for that little bit more. Here we go. He's got to press OK and go for it. And here we go. 78 minutes, 80, two strikers up there. I'm a little bit worried that we're going to get hit here because we're going for it. But at the same time, it has to be risk versus reward. The goal right now is important. But obviously, um, conceding would be the end of us. And Enrico's there straight at Rams. And hopefully, that's just the chance. Um, and we can go back to the drawing board here. 81, 82 minutes, 83 minutes. It looks like a twisted knee. That's not good. 84 minutes. Can we work the ball out? Rams in there. Finds Florian. It hasn't been the best of games from the Liverpool boys, but hopefully we can better win. That's a great kick in to the field there by Rams and straight in there. Benny Ott's ball over the top. Davis is there. Bradley Ward, if he can make numbers into the box. Good draw cross. Bradley Ward's there. Oh, just did we get a touch in the end? It's cleared. And can we get on the ball? Graham does. Can he look down the line here for Brad? It does, but it's not the best of balls. And maybe it's a chance for final on the break. It was definitely our chance at the moment. The ball comes in the cars with Bella. They've got numbers out here. Rams and save us. Oh, they hit the post. Tackled corner. <sighs> Would not have deserved that, that is for sure. In terms of what we can do, um, we're going to bring Deli Ali on for Martinez. Get Deli into this um, play. Get um, Pereira as a deep line playmaker on defend. Get Dali on um, as an advance, um, as an engadget, just sitting up there. Get Centeno going forward as a complete wing back on attack. Um, get Graham still just playing on that side there. And just look for the left-hand side a little bit more as well. Let's pass the ball into space. Really look to go for it here in the dying embers of this game. We need a win. We can't afford to draw this game. 88, 89, I tell you what, in five minutes out of time, we need a highlight right now. 92, 93, I tell you what, it's game over. We're in trouble in the Champions League group. Simple as that, ladies and gentlemen. We're in big trouble. We've played fairly well away from home. You know, we've created chances, but far out. It's just not going our way yet again. I'm going to get aggressive with the lads and just tell them you're not good enough again today. In terms of the Champions League, we're in some we're in some strife. We are in some strife. We go to the uh, league. We're going to be on free. We're going to be in third spot, and not just in third spot. We're going to be well behind. A draw against Pinewood, and it's day over, pretty much. We have to win the next game or at home. Very simply, 
Um, what am I trying to do here? Get to the Champions League here. We go to the Champions League. We go to, just you can see it here in Group B, right? We go all the way up. Group B, obviously, 7, 6, and 4. We win, we go ahead of Pinewood, and we would beat them in terms of we are ahead of you now um, on goal, um, not goal difference, results against teams, which is okay, right? We'll go to 7 points. RBL should be Olympiacos, means they're going to 9, right? But us on 7 means we can leapfrog them if we beat them away from home. Obviously, that's then just dangerous playing them away from home as well. We never should have lost the RBL game. For everybody on YouTube, though, that's going to be the end of the first part of episode 10. You'll see us for the final. It's a crunch game for the second time. We lose that game against final at home somehow. Like, just blow my mind. We're done. Finished. If we win, no, we're in a spot where if we know we win the last two games against RBL and, and um, Olympiacos, we're through. We're obviously then in a the spot then if we beat Olympiacos and RBL beat final, we're probably through there too. But in second, it is not what we want. See you in just a second though, YouTube. And Twitch, stay there because we obviously got the uh, two league games coming up in just a second. Hello YouTube, welcome back to part two of season of season ten. Part two of episode ten. You know, season two if we want to be technical about it. But here we are. Just seen RBL beat Olympiacos 3 0. What that means for us in the group is that if we want to top it, we have to win this game, go to seven points along with Final and jump them like that, and then beat RBL, which is the next Champions League game. We will show you that one there as well. Um, the thing is though, if we don't win that game, we don't we don't win today, we're in trouble. Simple as that. Match preview, here we go. We obviously played and drew with final last game. We're going to get into team selection as well. It's going to be that sort of lineup at the moment, um, as you see there. Just have to go and win this game. Have to be solid. Um, in terms of what's happened in the previous couple of games at the moment, as you can see, we beat Southampton 1 0. We're quite lucky. This is quite a goal from Trent as well. It's like a superb goal. It's a good free kick here from Trent um, in the Southampton game. And as you saw there, we lost two other Newcastle. We did rotate the side mostly but not overly and we just poor so as you can see from there great free kick from Trent brilliant stuff we lost it there to 2-1 there we see slightly rotates like not apparently the second goal which went in is JJ's fault it wasn't you know he's just come out made himself big it's gone under him it just happens it's more than the fault of the rest of the defence Florian and Ollie are starting to play quite well together so we're going to take Ollie off, off the bench actually you know nah, I don't know what to do with this kid I get, I get a little bit hit and miss about what's going on with him but we'll see how we go We've got to continue forward and hopefully we'll be okay. We're going to submit the team. We have to be final today. This is huge. This also ends the stream. It's a 6 hour 20 minute stream at the moment. This will be the last one to end the stream. We know about the team. We've just seen it before. We're going to get into there. If we can hear Discord going, it's because of my Discord chat's going off. We should be winning this game fairly comfortably. I'm going to put the pressure on. Sayers back from injury. This is the second start. It started against Newcastle, but only took him to play him a half. Have to win. Have to win. Get into the tunnel. Enjoy these games a lot. Obviously, we'd rather have him because Benny Ock kicked him up an injury. Can't deny that makes things easier for us, but obviously, still a good side. There we are. And hopefully, we can do well. Santa Maria Pereira now. He finds Centeno. We have to win here. It's a cold, wet night at Anfield. We have to get Anfield rocking. We have to win. Sayers with an early cross in. It's cleared away, but only Spanish Florian surely. Back inside the Santa Maria. Hits it! Come on! That's a big goal! Santa Maria makes it one new inside two minutes. We have to win today. That puts us up in the second. Title points of final. We were going, um, we're ahead of them on um, results against teams. Um, also, our goal difference is superior, which means if we beat oh, if we beat um, RBL or we're level on points of RBL and our results against teams are the same, we would obviously get up. Can we make it 2 0 straight away? Brad's ball in, headed there. Ollie there, it's just wide. Ollie couldn't get a flick on. Instead, he might have chose to leave it there from Florian's head over. It's gone just wide. Dominating the game, not giving him a shot. But how many times have we seen this year they have one shot where they can, we can see and finishes 1 1? We need a second. It's as simple as that. Come on, boys. Keep going. Keep driving. Keep playing the way you're playing. Come on, boys. We don't care how the win comes. We just need this result, obviously. But we obviously need to score a second here. Just put my nerves at rest. Final on it. They haven't created anything. It's a long throw. Graham wins. Pereira knocks on. Finds Martinez. No, he doesn't. No foul. <sighs> Thought he was going to get sent off there. No foul again. Final now. Looking for something. Can we get on it, though? They're working it well. That's a good boy over there, Enrique. He's missed the challenge. Can we... Well, he's right to trip Radzman, but he doesn't. 
was going to say, can Rasmus save us? And the chip went in there. And all of a sudden, find all the last couple of minutes, comes back into it, but can Oli get on the ball? Can we knock it into feet? Finds Martins. Martins finds Pereira. Pereira back onto it. Finds Martins. Finds Santa Marina. He's full find Sayers. Can Sayers find Alessio? He does. Alessio comes inside. Still with Alessio. Near post. Alessio! 2 0. Huge goal. Big goal. Come on, boys. Unbelievable scenes. Pereira, his ball there, finds Martinez, finds Santa Maria, finds Sayers. Sayers with a great through ball there. Alessio comes in, runs at his man, near post. We put the 2 0 ahead. Just tells us just a little bit easier, a little bit better. It makes us feel slightly more at ease about this game. And I say all this, and final could probably score right now, and then it would be back on, you know, squeaky bum time. We have to win this game. The boy over the top, Enrico surely was offside. Ollie's going to get there first. Can we just give it back to Rams Linden goals? Lay it back out here. Finds Florian. Florian now, he's been in good form, Florian, as well. Finds Pereira. Pereira now finds Centeno. Centeno now on the ball, running at his man. Can he find a good cross in? Centeno, they ball in. Sayers, not con, should have scored. Sayers really should have scored then. Here we go. 45 minutes, 46 minutes, 47 minutes played, half time. Can we do it? Get into half time. Tell the boys to not get complacent. Simple as that. Look stressed, do you, Florian? Look. You weren't that bad, but there's more to come for you. He looks motivated. Come on, boys. We're 45 minutes away from being second in the group. Um, and then hopefully we'll be okay. 46 minutes gone. 47 minutes gone. Can we go and hold on? 49, 50 minutes played. Come on, boys. Keep on just playing the way you are and get home. 56, 57. Come on, lads. We, once again, we have not been clinical with our chances. 61 play. Look, Sayers not having the best of games out there. We're going to bring Bradley Ward on there just to give him some. Actually, no, I'm going to take that back. Get Gary Davis on. There we are. Confirm sub. There we are. 67, 68, 69, 70 minutes. Corner. Alessio, make it 3 0 and kill this game. Ollie! That's a big goal. That's huge. Ollie Woodward. Yes, get pumped up, son. The fans are cheering everywhere. Alessio's ball in, Oli with a flick on header, good cross from Alessio, bang, 3 0, we're dominating the game, it looks good right now, doesn't it? Martinez there on a booking, we can't afford to get him signed off, sent off. We're going to bring on um, Delhi Ali just to play in there, same system though. Delhi can go on and play in the Champions League, that's fine by me. Um, we've not long left to go though, we're probably going to just keep it as it is and maybe make one more change late doors. As, um, Florian gets on the ball, finds Centeno. Centeno finds Pereira. Pereira now finds uh, um, Oli there. Oli Woodward, can he find his pass? Finds Delhi. Delhi here, can he play a nice ball through? Finds Brad. Brad Santa Maria hits the bar. Good chance there. In terms of what we're going to do, um, Davis can go and play out the wing. We're going to get Bradley Ward on last last minute there, just to give um, Brad a little bit of a rest here with the game. Fairly much won. How are you, mother? I'm good. That's good. 90th minute, 91st, 92nd, 93rd. It is game over. Thank God for this one. Simple as that. Thank God. Liverpool free, final nil. We dominate, we put our chances away, and that is what I'm talking about. Good win, boys. Well done. In terms of what that means for us in the group, it's very, very, very simple. In Group B, we are now going to be second on the same points as them. Um, pretty big for everyone invo invo involved as it did. It was a great start. There we are. We obviously bit that. Um, Ward's nearly close to um, triggering some cause. But if we go back to home, we go to ECC, we go to Group B. As you can see, tied on points. We've been by far the better side. How we lost this game and how we drew this game, we do not know. But that happens in football. Next game coming up on YouTube is going to be the RBL game. It's not too far away. And that's a game for who can top the group. Win that game there, right? And we just have to beat Olympiacos from day. We are top. We draw that game final, we could jump past, we could be as third, and then it all depends what happens between Firewood and RBL. Um, draw against RBL, we're in an okay spot, but not in a great spot as well. But we'll see how everything goes. Everybody on YouTube, though, that's going to be the end of the episode. Thank you for watching. See you next time on the YouTube. As always, follow us on Twitch down below um, in the links. It's also our Facebook, link and our Twitter link, so you can stay up to date so we know we're all on stream. For everybody on Twitch, though, we're going to go sign off on that very soon but we'll do that after we finish this youtube video for everybody on youtube thank you for checking us out that's the end of episode 10 it's been a stressful stream this one the six hour stream it's been six and a half hour now it's just been very stressful from the moment we've turned it on today football manager and it's been a stressful couple of episodes but look there seems to be a little bit of light at the end of the tunnel i'll see you for episode 11 against rbl and olympiacos and i'll catch you next time thank you and goodbye